Friday morning. It's 5 a.m. I am just arriving at the gym. I'm going to do half hour cardio. I'm going to do incline walk on the treadmill just to warm up. And then I'm going to set up for class. It is freezing. To So I'm going to start this incline walk, and uh, yeah, don't mind the machine. I'm going to watch the last part of the Shane Dawson series because I am addicted. I didn't think I would be, but I am. I couldn't wait for it. All right, so see ya. Hey guys, so I'm just finishing up. I have 10 minutes left here on the Stairmaster. I'm just taking a second to breathe. Whew. And... I'm going to do today, before I start today's leg day, I'm doing it with Hazel. You've seen her in a few of my videos. I like, we kind of push each other and it gives that little oomph and I really enjoy that. But I'm going to do, oh, I can't breathe. I'm going to do my mobility. What is important about stretching before your workout? Um, making sure you get the mobility and dynamic warm up and making sure that you stretch properly before you just kind of go and go into it. Sorry for the lighting, I'm using my iPhone. I'm just on a ramble. So the importance of stretching before dynamic stretching, really stretching out before you do leg day, any day, whatever you're going to do to make sure the focus is that it's all, so you don't get injured. And being 32, sometimes the body doesn't work the same way. So I'm gonna put you through one of my stretching routines today, give you the leg day, kind of go from there. And yeah, stay on track. Okay, bye. Jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Okay, what you're gonna need is a band. You can use a thick band, small band, something, a rope at home, and you just need something to be able to attach it to. So whatever works. <coughs> For you, it's up to you depending on what is good, but I'm gonna use this green one here because I'm at the gym. Well, let's get stretching.